So here we are in the Carmel mountain, and this is a holy mountain. The name Carmel itself is known throughout the world. It actually comes from two separate words, Kerem and El, the vineyard to God. So a holy mountain, it's dedicated to the prophet Elijah, uh, to the Druze religion, to the Christians and Jews alike, Muslims. Everybody has a special place on this mountain. There is a really interesting natural habitat here. We've actually come here today looking for a very, very specific flower, which is just above where I'm standing, although it's just before the flowers are about to open. It's a lily that's mentioned in the Bible, the largest wildflower in Israel. And in about a week or two, this flower is going to be open. So when you come, you'll have to come visit this spot in May so we can come and visit these flowers. Over on the other side, you can see lots of caves and very interesting rock formations here from the very hard limestone. Cast caves, stalagmites, stalactites, a whole variety of animals, including a wild animal which is being reintroduced now called the yachmur. It's a deer that used to be on the table of King Solomon himself. And we might, if we're lucky, see some of these very timid animals out here in the forest of Carmel. 